technically he got the wrong Technically, he got the wrong Technically, technically. What's up, what's up, YouTube? Back with another video. Today, we're doing Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? And we got my first <laughs> What's up, YouTube? What's up, baby? <laughs> I told y'all that we did the next video. Stop playing on me. <laughs> Come on, man. Let's get it. Let's get it. Come on. And we're going to do Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? I'm going back to ask him one question. I'm going to ask him five. Okay. So, okay. What is the 384 rounded off to the nearest 10? Bro, what? Basically, what is 384 rounded to the nearest 10? 384. Bro, what? Oh. Hey, 384. It's my answer. Come on. No, I'm, like, I'm gonna re ask you that question. What is 384 rounded to the nearest 10? <laughs> Not 10, 10. 380. Thank you, thank you. Okay, you redeemed yourself. Okay, for the second question, I'm gonna let <laughs> me get What's a up? little pipeline. <laughs> so, okay. What number is the Roman numeral XVI? <laughs> I'm like, oh <laughs> This is a black people I just like. <laughs> <laughs> how do I wait? How do I wait? X V I S X T. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Nigga, you're just stupid. Like, you're you're stupid. Like, I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. Be like, boom. Okay. <laughs> now we're gonna go to the next question. For the third question, we're gonna ask you another simple one. <laughs> how many minutes are in a half hour? Thirty. Oh my gosh, I thought he was about to get that wrong. Okay, I'm so proud of you. Come on, keep it going. Keep it coming, keep it okay, coming. Okay. Up? Fourth question. I'm really him. Let's 23 it. times four. 23 times four. All right, all right, all right, all right. Give, hey, hey, hey. Ask me that one more time. 23 times four. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. 23 times four, wait. Yes. Two, four, six, eight. Times 23, 6, wait, 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 12, ah, 92, yes, 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 sir, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm really him, I'm I really do this, I told y'all I'm him, okay, okay. Come, keep it coming, okay, okay. keep it coming, fifth keep question, coming. fifth Let's question, go. okay, fifth question, fifth question, this is going to be a hard one, how many feet are, wait, okay, wait, if a football field is 100 yards long, right. how many feet long is the football field? So three times a hundred. Three hundred. Hey! I'm really okay. him! I'm okay. really him! Okay. It's, it's, I'm... You had a dream that, that you, um, you had, you, you, you could... It's, it's three <laughs> feet in a yard. I'm him. I do this. Okay. Come on, ask me now we're about to go to the next contestant. With my next contestant, Drew Betts. Somewhere around here, down there, or something. Okay. You know what I'm Instagram, saying? Snapchat. Snapchat, Instagram, make sure you add it all, you know. TikTok, TikTok. Drew Betts underscore, or Sheila Betts. You know what I'm saying? TikTok stuff, but. Um, yeah. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> uh, Drew is pretty Nah, you know what, Drew? I'm gonna, gonna, I'm gonna uh, start you off with an easy one. Easy. What? Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin were the first two men in the entire world to do what? Go to the moon. We'll specifically, do what on the moon? Put the flag in the moon. Or walk, 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 walk. Hey, walk. Okay. Hey, I give okay. that one. Okay. Oh. What are the two main languages spoken in South America? This is a continuation from your first question. Spanish. Yeah. And um. <laughs> do da do 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 da do do da do. Can I get a help? Can I get a hint? You want to help one? Do you know this? I think I do. Okay. You want to call it? Hey, it's Dylan here. Okay. Um, okay. She loved Dylan. You know, okay. know what I'm saying? Uh, I think I think the answer is English. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> English? He's a South American. Bro. No, no, because because they can speak English too. 
Nah, don't don't talk, don't talk down on me. Don't Chris talk got, down on me, bro. Chris got the drip on, no cap. Cause, cause I'm nice to you guys. What language do Brazilians speak? I don't know. I said Brazilian, so I don't know. Yes! Portuguese! Portuguese! Portuguese. Yes. Stop playing with me! I got it! I got it! Let's go! Let's go! go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, so we had to change up the setup. Third question is, what are the animals without backbones known as? A. Vertebrates. Brates. Two. Invertebrates. Three. Omnivores. Four. Carnivores. Uh, two. What was it? Invertebrates? Right? Okay, Drew! Yes, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yes, sir! Yes, yeah. sir! Ding, ding, ding. Yeah. You know it's not. Yeah, yeah, it's not okay. Can you name the island which is considered both as an island and a continent? A. Monaco. Two. Africa. Three. Australia. Four. Vatican City. Africa? <laughs> <laughs> Australia. Now you got that wrong. That's crazy. Okay, so last question is which is the thinnest layer of the earth? A inner core, B mantle, C crust, D outer core. The mantle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna give you one more try. I'm gonna give you one more try. I'm gonna give you one more try, Drew. Stop trying to cheat. I'm not cheating. I thought the mantle. I'm gonna give you one more try, Drew. Okay, repeat the. Okay, so it's not the mantle. So A, inner core. C, crust. D, outer core. Inner core. You thought, bro. bro. Okay, okay. It was the answer. He said inner core. It was the crust. I said the crust. I've never seen the crust. I said it was wrong. The first time we asked questions, no, I said the crust. Oh, God, God, I said crust the first time. You said mantle. Bro. No, the first time we recorded it. So I was like, it's a mantle. You said mantle. This one, I said mantle, but I'm talking about the video before. I said the crust. Go go through the clips. Go through the clips. Next contestant, Fred Lucky. Yeah. I'm gonna have a social down uh, in the description or on the video right here. Um, so let's start you off with a little easy question. How many sides does a hexagon have? 10, 8, 7, or 6? Six? 6. Okay, Fred, I see you. Okay. okay. You can do math. Okay. On to <laughs> What is the superlative of good? Better, more good, most good, or best? Do you need to know what superlative means? I think it's best. This is a guess. Yes, sir, Fred. Okay. Okay, yes, sir, okay. my boy, Fred. Okay. IQ. Okay, I see you. Okay. IQ, All right, All right, that's two for two. Okay. Okay. Next question is, which number does this Roman symbol represent? X, X, X. B I thirty six. What was the answer? Thirty six. That's a dub. Dang, Fred is on street. Thirty six. Yes. yes. Oh, I didn't you know, you don't know Roman numerals. Next question is, what does A M stand for? Oh my god, <laughs> bro, are you serious? This is first grade. He does not know this. He does not know this. I promise he does not know this. Look. What does A stand for? He's just asking, bro. He's just asking. No, he does not know this. I don't know it. Oh, I knew that. What's the answer? Give it a guess. What's the answer choices? Don't give me answers. Post, I'll give you answer choices. Oh, Post meridian, <laughs> ante meridian, <laughs> antum meridian, or ant meridian. Shut up, Sean. Sean, shut up. Repeat, repeat the um, choices in here. Sean, don't do that, bro. <laughs> A is post meridian. B is antum meridian. <clears throat> C is ante meridian. And D is ant meridian. Antum meridian. B. Wait, so antum meridian? Yes. Or ante meridian? Ant. <laughs> ant. The first one, what you just said. Fred, I'm gonna repeat this one more time. Okay, okay, I'm gonna repeat okay, this okay, one more okay, time. Okay. A is Antum Meridian. Mm -hmm. B is Ante Meridian. And then C is Antum? Oh, wait. You I mixed up B and C. I messed yeah. them up. Wait. Okay. 
But I'm saying Just tell me what AM is, man. Just tell me what AM is. Anti Meridian. Anti Meridian? Yes. I'm going to give him the credit. Right. Even though it was like. You said this is right or wrong. Bro, yes or no? There's no partial credit. I really do card. Okay, last question is Name the month the attack on Pearl Harbor took place. Do I give you answer choices? I'll give you answer choices. A. June. B. October. C. December. D. November. I'm gonna give you one more try. Okay. So you got A. June. B. Wait, what was it? <laughs> October. October. D. Okay. C. December. And D. November. I'm gonna choke slide you on the fucking floor. December. I'm gonna choke slide you on the thing. Cause it was out of it was out of Yes, paper. sir. My boyfriend got four out of five questions I'm smart. right. I'm a smart. Like I said, he's gonna have his uh, socials in the description. Facts. Uh, so y'all go follow him on there. On to the next contestant. Facts. Yeah. Yo, what's good, YouTube? What's up? Socials right here. Okay, so as you can see, this is the talking one. Um, this is my boy Connor Rainey. Put his social down in the description. He's no, not. right here. Put it on the screen. Right here, right here, right here. Uh, Instagram, Twitter. I don't have a YouTube channel yet. Bro. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You know what? Just for that. Snapchat. Snapchat. Alright, man. Okay, just for that, I'm gonna get my hard question first. The Machu Picchu oh, is located in the rich country. Bro, can we change bro? <laughs> Uh, uh, stop uh, trying to give him the answer, bro. Am I right? No, 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 wait. The Machu Picchu is located in which country of South America? You can't give me the answer choice? Okay, yeah, I will give you the answer choice. Colombia? Argentina? <laughs> Put your head down, you're trying to cheat. Venezuela? Uh, America. And Peru? Uh, Nah, bro, can I not like look straight, bro? I cheat. I'm not trying to look straight. I'm not trying to look straight. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Alright, can you stress one more time? No, bro, stop. Okay. Colombia, 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 Argentina, Venezuela, and Peru. It was the what? Choo Choo? Machu Picchu. Well, that's, stop. That stop. sounds like something from Peru. Am I correct? Is that your answer choice? Bro, Dylan, you cheated. Bro, <laughs> what? It was a, it was a <laughs> cheat. You cheated, bro. You was like, hoo, hoo, hoo. you know, but I'm, I'm gonna be nice, man. I'm gonna give you that one. Thank you. Man. Got shit. Yeah. Okay. What? You know, we always gotta do a Roman numeral question. So, which number does the Roman symbol L V I represent? Yeah, L V I. I 106. <laughs> Yo, this dude. This dude. I don't know the Roman numerals like that. Bro, bro you said LVI? Oh my L -V -I. god. Uh, LVI. Bro, I don't know my Roman numerals. Back up, bro. That's a name, bro. I don't, I don't know what the L is, bro. I don't know what the L is. Bro, you don't know what L means? No. I never studied Roman numerals. Okay, bro. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to wish your answer. This, this, this L you finna take. <laughs> I'm gonna smack you, bro. Okay, what's your answer choice, Connor? He probably knows what L is. He's a study. I don't know. Study, bro. Okay, shut, shut up. Connor. You already cussed, bro. You're already cussed. It was already done. Kids, see my card. Alright, um. I'm saying. 56. Yes. There's no way you just got that out of nowhere. Well, it's either 100 or 50. No! So There's no way. You know what? 56. Yeah, I, I was playing with you. I was playing with you, bro. Yes. I was playing with you, bro. No, he was not. I was playing with you. Bro, did Dylan give me an answer again? I'm glad you did. Okay, I'm gonna give you that. We're gonna go to the next one. Let's go! And which group of people were the first ones to celebrate Thanksgiving? The Pilgrims? 
Yeah. Okay, Connor, since you know everything and stuff, you want a little bit of a hot streak, we're going to hit you with a hard question. You like that? No, I don't. Uh, can we just go easy, bro? Nah. Since you know everything. It better not be geography, bro. Just nah, you know what? I'm not going to hit you with geography. It's going to be history. In which year did Thomas Edison invent the light bulb? What the fuck? Bro, shut up, Sean. I know this one. I don't care. <laughs> bro, that's crazy. You know what? Listen to Sean. Say what he said. Do it. No, bro. <laughs> that means I got it wrong. That means I said it wrong. Can I get a hint? I'll give you answer choices. Okay, answer choices. Let's go. 1869. Okay. 1875. Mm-hmm. 1879 mm-hmm. or 1880. Say 1869. Bro, that was the earliest time. You know, it was the earliest no, time. No, 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 no. You wrong. <laughs> I'm wrong. <laughs> 1879. Damn. Shit, bro. Okay. Get it. Last question. This is an easy one. You should know this. Where is Harvard University? Bro, oh my god! Bro, I can't do any more. You bro. stupid. <laughs> bro, you don't know. Can I get answer choices, Prince? Oh, oh he's short, man. Can choices. I get an- uh, bro, answer choices? Bro, I'm asking for it. Alright, give him choice answers. Give him choice answers. Okay. I'm gonna give you a I'm gonna give you a hand. I'm gonna give you a hand. Just give me answer choices. Okay, you know what? Fine, fine. Short man. Uh, alright, bro. Hey, I'm gonna go back to my school. I'm gonna go sailing around. A, New York. B, Pennsylvania. Mm-hmm. C, uh, Massachusetts. D, New Hampshire. Bro, context clues, right? Context All right, what was clues. the first two uh, questions? I mean, first two answers. What was it? Uh, Pennsylvania and New York. Right? Yeah. Pennsylvania. And then C was uh, Massachusetts and D. Was he chose New Hampshire. Pennsylvania. That's your answer. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Good answer. Don't tell me. Ladies and gentlemen. Wrong! Oh my god. You know where it's at? You wanna know? Don't tell me New York, bro. Don't tell me New York. It's not in New York, bro. Massachusetts. No way. He was thinking about it. Yeah, I know. I was trying to trick him. I was trying to trick him. I knew. I was trying to trick him. I was like, nah. 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 I was our contestant, Sean, uh, Connor Rainey, we're going to have his socials in the you description. You want my socials right here, right here, and right here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, on to the next contestant. Okay, so we back. <laughs> Bro, he already trying to cheat. Okay, so we back here with my next contestant, Sean Watson. Socials are gonna be down in the description as well. Uh, um, so we're gonna get them started on the first question. Question one: Which geometrical shape has no vertices? Come on, bro. This is easy. Hold on. A circle. Bruh. Wrong. Ah, right, give me that chance. Vertices. What's Already? A vertice? Yeah. What's a vertice? Like corners. Like a, corner. a circle has no corners. No. Geometrical shape that means like 3D. Oh, cylinder. I'm not a cylinder. Bruh. A sphere. Yes, okay, okay, okay. I'm proud of you. Okay. It, it's the same thing. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? It's like a 3D circle. It's not. Okay, it's the same thing, guys. Okay, next question. If I had nine dozen eggs, how many eggs would I have? I had nine dozen. Eggs. Nine dozen. One oh eight. Okay, so yeah, I see. Okay. Okay. How many? You know what? I'm gonna hit you with a hard one. Pause. What are the full forms of AM and PM as used in representing time? What'd you say? What do AM and PM stand for, basically? Don't get any such choices? How do you get Okay, okay. You know Wait, what? I'm gonna. Because Fred's was like. Ah? Uh, uh? 
I'll be nice. I'll, I'll, I'll only make you answer one. Do you want to answer AM or PM? AM. Okay. So I'll give you answer choices. Ant Meridium. Ante Meridium. Ante Meridium. Meridium? Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, or keep C going, keep going, keep going. C Just keep going. So A, Ant Meridium. B, Ant Meridian. C, Ante Meridian. D, Ante Meridium. Ante Meridian. Ante. How do Wait. I? C or D? Wait, what? Meridian or Meridium? That's 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 the answer to a song. <laughs> D. Ante Meridian. Yes. It was Ante. No, it was Ante. It was Ante. You stupid. Yeah. You stupid. <laughs> okay. What number does the Roman numeral? X, 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 B, I, I, I represent. Uh, X, 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 that's 30, B, 35, I, I, 38. Are you sure? Yes. Are you really, really Yes, sure? bro. It's 38. <laughs> Stop trying. Come on, it's yeah, 38. It's 30. Okay, on, okay. Smile, smile. Smile. You know, you got it wrong. I'm not going to count it. It's 38. Come on, bro. It's 38. I'll give him that one. But on to the next question. How many grams? How many grams go into one kilogram? This is your last and final question. John Watson. Can I get a range? Can I get a range? No. I can't get a range? No, this is easy. This is basic measurements. It's not. Yes, it is. It's not. This is like... We don't use grams. Yes, we do. Oh, yeah, well, we do, but like... You we know. don't use them as many times, I guess. Yes. You should still know this. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> wait, can you repeat that? So you're saying there's eight grams. I did not say that at all. You just said eight. Yeah. Bruh. Bruh. <laughs> What's your answer, Joyce, bro? It's a lie, isn't it? Like, yes, it's a lot. So, like, a thousand something. So, what's your answer choice? It's a thousand something. It's not an answer choice. It's up there in the thousands, bro. That counts, bro. No, it does. Okay, you know what? Bro, it counts. This is stolen. I'm going to give you an answer. I'm going to give you a range. Yeah, thank you, bro. Okay, so A, 0 to 500. So B, 500 to 750. C seven fifty to a thousand. Mm -hmm. D a thousand to fifteen hundred. D. That's correct. You didn't even let me finish. It's C. What is that then? What is it? You know, like, technically I did kind of make a mistake. So technically he got. Oh my gosh. So technically he got. Oh. So technically he. <laughs> Technically got it right because I said a thousand to fifteen hundred. The answer was a thousand. So I'm gonna give Sean the credit on that one. And I think that wraps it up for our It was exactly a thousand? It was exactly a thousand. I think that wraps it up for our contestant Sean Watson. Wow. We're going to our next contestant. See you guys later. Back with my next contestant, Quinn Williams, aka Big Lips. Uh, so he's going. <laughs> I'm gonna have his socials down in the description, just like the other contestants. He's my last contestant, so hopefully he does the best. So yeah. First question: The Battle of Gettysburg was fought in which war? Civil War. Yes, it is. It's a dub. It's a nice little dub. Nice little dub. Even I knew that one though. Oh, yeah. sure, you're dumb, okay? You're dumb. Okay. You're going to get past round one. All right, come on. Next question. How do you spell Mississippi? Is it M? Okay, let me start. M I S S I S S I P P I. Got a spelling champion. There's a dog. Okay. Maybe I should have done spelling. I never did spelling before. You know what I'm saying? I never did in your middle school. Nah, I was like afraid. I thought it was like bad.
what? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Bro, I'm out, man. I'm just tripping. Next question, even though you sus. Which is the thinnest layer of the earth? Inner core, mantle, crust, or outer core? I, I think, think it's, it's I think it's the crust. Okay, three out of three, Q. Yes, sir. This is still Q, Bob. Oh, stupid. Right. Okay, don't, 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 don't let your hand get pumped up too much. On to the next question. Okay, next question. This will be a little bit of a trick question. Mm -hmm. If I'm in third place, okay, and I pass the second person yeah, in a race, what place am I? So if you're in third place and you pass the second person in a race, you're in first place. If you pass, wait, you're saying if you're in third place, that's his final answer. That's his final answer. What was second? Passing the second place, and then you're picking oh, the second place. Oh, that's got a lot for you, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Bro, are you Ooh. stupid? Sean, I think you got that wrong. You didn't ask me that question. It's clearly second place. Last question. Let's see if you can get this. Where is Machu Picchu located? A, Brazil. B, Argentina. C, Peru. Or D, Columbia. All I need is my lifeline. You can't know you can use your lifeline. I need, I need a lifeline. No. I better not be one of the lifelines. I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know what a Machu Picchu is. Argentina, Brazil, Colombia, Colombia. Expert 50 50. What's that Machu Picchu is a country? Bro, you ain't never heard of Machu Picchu, bro. I've heard of <laughs> Machu Picchu. I've Whatever he said, bro. But I haven't heard of like. I thought it was like its own country. It's something. I don't know. I think it's in. Bro. Are, are, are you okay, bro? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay. Have you ever heard of Machu Picchu being a country? No, I just heard the name. But I thought it was own country. Bro, just answer, bro. Okay, so it's not Brazil. I don't think. How do you know it's not Brazil? Oh, I, I feel like it's not really good. Okay, okay. So I, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go Argentina. Is that your final answer? Final answer, Argentina. Are you sure? I promise you, Argentina. Are you like really, really sure? Man, he got it no, right. No, I don't know any of them. I don't know. I'm just guessing. I'm guessing Argentina. Dang. He got it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> he got it wrong. <laughs> it was Peru. Cool. Okay. And it's not a country. It's like a historical place, like the ruins and stuff. Oh, yeah, he would have never guessed that. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. <laughs> he did a great job, even though he's still. I really do this shit, man. He's still trash. But, but. Like I said, go follow all the socials. It'll be hey, down hey, in the description with everybody else and all the other contestant socials. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Subscribe, share with your friends. I'm out.